you became a world champion today without uh, giving up a single point throughout the whole tournament. Does that a factor at all? I mean, it looks like you got hit with a pretty good foot sweep and you figured out how to scramble out of it and not, and, and not you know, get scored on at all. Um, yeah, I don't um, go into a tournament with the goal of like, oh, I want this many points or I don't want to get scored on this much. Um, but when I started working with Valentin, he really sharpened up my defense a lot and we've been doing, you know, down blocks, re shots, all that stuff. So um, I've just seen some progression in my tournaments throughout the year and that's kind of been um, maybe the common occurrence and it's a good sign for me. Here in the first period. Nice shot okay. by Helen. Yeah. She gets in on that single leg right into the gut wrench position. Let's see if she goes for it. US athletes, US athletes are very strong, very fit. Nice takedown. Once again. So in the United States, we have um, what, seven out of the states with state station women's wrestling programs. So clearly there's a dire need um, for there to be more support and more opportunities for the girls. And I think when we can have a world championship on US soil or when we can have it, you know, alongside the men and people that maybe came to watch, you know, Brett Metcalf today might see some of the women's matches, you know, I think it just really helps and grows support for women's wrestling. What would your message be to young girls across the country who, who are wrestling or thinking about wrestling? You know, what do you want to inspire out of the, young, the youth of uh, the United States of America? I really hope those young girls realize that there are opportunities out there. I thought I was going to go and play four years of college soccer and then go into the working field. And there's nothing wrong with that life. But boys in this country have this opportunity to dream big and be able to look at NBA stars and NFL stars and all of these Olympic medalists out there. Because there's so many opportunities for those boys to look up to them. And girls don't have that. We have recently had those Serena Williams, and we've had a couple soccer stars here and there. But we really need to show them that it's not just in those mainstream sports. There's opportunities all across the board. USA Wrestling is a great example. i have education fully covered. I live and train at the Olympic Training Center. I'm a professional athlete, and I don't think girls know that they have that option, that they can work hard every single day and get to that point. And it's such a, an amazing life I'm living, and I just really want them to realize that that's an option that they can go to school and play a sport. They can go and dedicate themselves really hard and become a world champion at something they never even dreamed of. I want them to have that dream so it starts younger.